Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. On Windows, we get the system tray that is found in the bottom right hand corner of the taskbar. And as many of you know, one of the main purposes and functions of the system tray is to hide the app icons for the apps that are running in the background on your device. Now, if you have been running and using Windows 11 now for some time, you will know that the option to reorder and drag and drop the default system app icons in the system tray in the taskbar like your battery volume and wi-fi is unavailable currently in the stable version of windows 11 but that is still an option that is available over on windows 10. now if we go to the show hidden icons which opens the hidden icons overflow menu most users will prefer to place their non-system app icons into the overflow menu and also apps they don't use on a regular basis and currently in the stable version of windows 11 we have the option and the ability to drag and drop and rearrange and reorder those app icons in the overflow menu and also to place some of those uh, in the system tray menu in the taskbar and then we can also do some housekeeping as an example and hide those just to declutter the system tray now this option to rearrange and drag and drop and reorder the system app icons uh, in Windows 11 could be a feature that Microsoft will be disabling and discontinuing in the future builds and in future builds of Windows 11. Now my reason for saying this that is that Microsoft has recently started testing in the Insider program, which I have posted on previously, but just to recap, a tablet optimized taskbar with two states. Now this is on tablets with a touch screen. The first state is the collapsed state, which shows critical status icons only. And the second state is expanded state, which allows for easier touch interactions. Now, because of this new feature, uh, which they are testing um, to optimize the taskbar for uh, tablets uh, on, with uh, touchscreen devices, um, Microsoft, according to reports, could be removing features from the desktop version of the taskbar in Windows 11 in the future to optimize it for tablets. Now, reports suggest and also testing has been done uh, in builds 22572 or newer where um, it is now no longer possible to rearrange and reorder those app icons in the overflow menu and um, to drag and drop them into the actual system tray um, menu as well. Now if Microsoft does decide to discontinue the drag and drop reorder option in the system tray I think that would be a bad move on their part. As I personally feel this is an option that is needed, needed as a basic option in the system tray in the taskbar just to do housekeeping and place things um, you know where you would like them personally and to your own preference and choice and also just to keep things neat and tidy um, you know in the system tray and the taskbar. Now if they do decide to discontinue the feature in the future which I hope they don't there are one or two things you can do in the taskbar settings to just you know um, uh, keep things neat and tidy and um, disable and enable apps in the system tray and to do this we just right click on the taskbar we go to taskbar settings and in the personalization taskbar page here you will see taskbar corner overflow which says choose which icons may appear in the taskbar corner which is in the system tray in the actual taskbar all others will appear in the taskbar corner overflow menu which is the overflow show hidden icons um, overflow menu as mentioned and if we expand that yeah you can have some options for the different apps that you have installed where you can enable or hide those icons depending on your own personal choice and preference to appear in the actual system tray taskbar menu or the overflow hidden icons menu now while we are speaking about um, background apps and the system tray um, apps just on a side note if you are running a low budget um, device with say low memory make sure you don't have an excess of apps and icons that you see in the overflow menu or in the system tray because every icon you see is an app that is running in the, in the background which will have processes running in the background to keep that app running even if you don't see the app open on your desktop which will use extra system resources and obviously use up your memory especially if you're running a budget device with low memory so just bear that in mind and um, disable all the apps um, and exit out of them all the apps that you are not using on a regular basis in your system tray just to free up that memory usage so those processes don't run in the background especially on budget machines
So just wanted to let you know in bolds, double two, five, seven, two or newer, um, Microsoft is now, um, has disabled the option to drag and drop and reorder those app icons. And I will keep you posted as to developments. And I personally do hope though that that is an option and a feature that they do not discontinue in uh, future builds and versions of Windows 11. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.